shove up first. So there were two chaisas and two pixels to this thing. Um, that should be fine, right? So I need to just move forward. No, no, just, just, just move up. Just move up. There you go. Okay, so now you want this right here, right? Where the chest is, right there. And then angle towards me. Okay? And then we want to make sure that it's really board underneath. Okay, so now before we even touch, hold it with hold it here. So when you get your left hand, do a C. Like this. How about you hold it up, C, and then do it here. So straight jump all the way, and then a C right here. And all you're going to do is you're going to bring the hand and the, 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 the finger board that you grab it to. And then you want this third finger where your thumb is. So C doesn't need to see this. So right in the middle. So now, as I, if I do myself, watch. And this finger here, and the thumb's going to sit right here. So do a C, out here, and then right in the middle, and then just bring it in. So the fingerboard is right there. That's where we're going to hold it, okay? So now, all you're going to do, you're going to use one, one, three, and then the four. So you're going to do the first finger here on the tape, three, and then you're going to stretch the pinky all the way to four. Let's do the first string. Just the first string? Just just the, the high A? First string. There you go. Yeah, so on the sticker, on the C so sticker, first finger on the sticker. But this string, the high string. You have one, two, three, four strings? Yeah. There you go, right there. That one. First finger there, and then third finger there, and then stretch the pinky there. And then you can lift them up just a little bit, but, but don't do this. All right, we don't want to see this, so they're all elevated. Now do the second string. First finger, third finger, and then pinky. Now do the third string. First finger, there, there. And the last one, first finger. And then you still want your thumb, to stay in the back. Yeah, stay in the back. A little closer to the back. Yeah, so you still have a thumb supporting that. Do it again from the first, from the first string. One, two, and then three. Okay. Good. So now let's mention the bow. So what we're going to do here is. Let me see if I can do something here. Yes. So, hold this. Okay. So. What we're going to do is we're going to imitate how we're going to hold the bow. So you're going to have four fingers here, and you're going to take them twisting a little bit forward. So instead of this, we're for facing forward just a little bit. Yeah. So you do here? Yeah. So from here, and you just push into it. That should be enough. See how this is bent? So now when I get the bow, I'm going to have it here, and this thumb is going to favor this thing here. See how my, my finger is still facing facing forward instead of doing this so it's kind of facing forward so now see how the third finger lands up with the thumb third finger with the thumb same thing on the straight all right so we're looking at here pinky the uh, fourth third first and then thumb and the, and the middle finger in the front turn your hand there you go so now as you hold it right you shouldn't feel any tension it's still kind of relaxed mm -hmm. so now when you start moving all you're going to do is you move this over here so you're going to start here you're going to go up, start here, all you're going to do is you're going to move up, and then back down. But this should still kind of remain the same shape, right? So we're doing here, you're going to do up, and then back, here, and then here. Okay, now I'll give you the, the, the instrument. Show you. I'm going to go ahead and set it up, knee, chest, chest a little bit, there you go. Okay, so now I'm going to show you, fingers here, middle finger, thumb, as I play, all I'm going to do is, as you do here, all you do is push, moving the elbow, just hold it, okay, and then you see how it breaks here, on the bridge and the fingerboard here, mm -hmm. you want to make sure your bow stays right here in the middle, you don't want this or this, so you don't want hand no, it's too high, right. there you go, right there, because if you play up here, when you start using your fingers, you're going to get all this, uh, Got all this chopper here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now on the, on the second string, just pull. Good. Make sure you want to keep that motion going because if you slow down, if you, if you don't keep the both moving, it starts, it starts really. Alright, the power. You want a nice full. You can really use the whole entire bow. Okay, 
Check your fingers. Little finger, thumb, pinky, okay? And then just pull. And then make sure you kind of want to keep a little pressure down onto the string. Not too much, but that way it doesn't kind of bounce. See how it bounces? There you go. And now do the same thing and push forward. Start with the tip, tip a little. And then just push. Good. So now we're going to try this exercise. The circle of strings. You're going to start with the top string. Do this check. You're going to go string the top string check your fingers okay top string and then pull down ready one two three four When you play on the on the C string, right? I'm just sitting here, right? See how it's facing forward. Instead of doing this, yeah. when you play the string, it's gonna be no face to go. So you wanna this way, but when you, you play the space. string, so you can have space. Otherwise, you're gonna start hitting the D. So, sorry. So it'll be. Okay, if you get to the low string, you wanna have that space. So now we're going to try it again and make sure we have enough space for that C string. Yeah, see, so now when you hang over, you just open it up. Uh, start from the, the G string, the second string, second the bottom string. Okay, we're we'll taking the bottom string. Right there. One, two. So you're gonna do this here, here, here. Ready? So you can move it just a little bit, but instead of doing this, too much. Yeah. So just a little, little, little bit on it. Do it again. One, two. Uh, similar action, just on the on the on the D string. Now we're gonna do open the second string. The second string. Do the second. They're gonna do open. Oh, open. So one, two, three, four. And they're gonna do first finger. One, two, three, four. They're gonna do the third finger. So they're you're gonna go D and then go E. You make an F sharp here and then G. Ready? So open on the E. One. So open. So let's do this again. Do the C. So open and then. Yeah. Do, do the C first. Let's start with the C. Do the C. And then bring it in. So open, and then you're gonna go two, three, two, three, four, and then third finger. Okay, let's do open. Ready? One, two, open, and. So let's make sure we have the finger down, and then we start moving. Ready? One, two, open, and. Let's 
try again. Open finger. Oh, oh, open, open. Chord. Two, two, ready, and. So now, it just takes practice. That's, mm -hmm. That way you can get all the full, full movement. You want to try the ball, and you're going to do the fingering. Ready? One, two, open, open and... Sometimes in four, so it just takes it takes pushing down and moving. Okay, and I think we're done. Thank you.